फाइव सेकेंड्स टू गो स्टार्ट लिव ग्रांटेड दिस क्रिमिनल अपील इज डायरेक्टेड अगेंस्ट द इम्प्यून्ड जजमेंट एंड ऑर्डर डेटेड सेवन नवंबर टू थाउजेंड फोर्टीन पास्ट बाय द हाई कोर्ट ऑफ डेली एट न्यू डेली इन क्रिमिनल अपील नंबर सिक्स थ्री फोर ऑफ टू थाउजेंड एट वेयर इन द हाई कोर्ट हैज डिसमिस द अपील फाइल्ड बाय द अपीलांट एंड अप हेल्ड द ऑर्डर ऑफ कन्विक्शन एंड सेंटेंस पास्ट against the appellant by the court of special judge delhi for short the trial court in cc number 21 of 2005 the trial court convicted the appellant void its judgment dated 14 july 2008 for the offenses punishable under sections 7 and 13 1d read with 132 of the prevention of corruption act 1988 for short the pc act and wide order dated 15 july 2008 sentenced him to undergo rigorous imprisonment for 2 years with fine of rupees 5000 for the offense punishable under section 7 of the pc act and in default to undergo simple imprisonment for 2 months for the offenses punishable under section 132 of the pc act he was further sentenced to undergo rigorous imprisonment for 2 years with a fine of rupees 5000 and in default to undergo simple imprisonment for 2 months both the sentences imposed upon him for the above said offenses were to run concurrently brief facts of the case are stated here under to appreciate the rival legal contentions urged on behalf of the parties the prosecution case before the trial court was that on 29th july 2004 an fir number 662 of 2004 was registered at police station nangloi delhi under sections 279 and 337 of indian penal code for short ipc against one krishan kumar pw9 the brother of the complainant jay bhagwan pw2 krishan kumar was arrested on 29th july 2004 in connection with the alleged offenses referred to in the above said fir the complainant jay bhagwan pw2 had approached assistant sub inspector asi ranbir singh pw11 the investigating officer of the said case for release of krishan kumar on bail the investigating officer is stated to have accepted the bail bond for release of krishan kumar and directed the appellant a constable at the said police station to release him on bail in connection with the alleged offenses referred to supra the appellant alleged to have demanded a bribe of rupees 5000 from the complainant jay bhagwan for releasing his brother krishan kumar on bail it is alleged that under duress complainant jay bhagwan pw2 paid rupees 4000 as bribe to the appellant thereafter krishan kumar pw9 was released on bail and the appellant asked the complainant jay bhagwan to pay him the balance amount of rupees 1000 on 30th july 2004 between 6 pm and 7 pm at the chau kala bus stand nachavgarh the complainant jay bhagwan pw2 approached the office of anti corruption branch on 30th july 2004 and made a written complaint regarding the demand of bribe by the appellant from him the said written complaint was recorded by sundar dev pw12 in presence of anup kumar verma pw6 the complainant jay bhagwan took with him two government currency notes for short the gc notes in the denomination of rupees 500 each and handed over the same to inspector sundar dev pw12 
who noted down the serial numbers of the said gc notes thereafter phenol thallium powder was applied to the said gc notes and recorded in the pre read proceedings and its effect was demonstrated the tainted gc notes were given to the complainant jay bhagwan who kept the same in the left pocket of his shirt as per the instructions punch witness anup kumar verma pw6 was directed to remain close to complainant jay bhagwan to overhear the conversation between the complainant jay bhagwan and the appellant he was further instructed to give a signal to the raiding party by hurling his hand stop